Hey y'all, happy March. So I am going to give you guys the favorite of this month. And well, I've kind of purchased a couple of bigger things this month. I got a Kate Spade purse. Um, I got it on sale for like 65% off. So if you want a Kate Spade purse, definitely check the sales because you don't want to pay full price for that. But if you're interested in getting one, I love it and it's definitely worth the money. So look for a good sale. The other thing that I've gotten this month that is kind of pricey is my college class ring. Like, what the heck? Where has the time gone? I have no idea, but um, it's time for me to get a college class ring. Um, it was a good chunk of change, but it's definitely worth it since I'm going to wear it forever. So it was okay to buy that. And then um, those were the two bigger things that I got this month, but that was not my favorite of the month. My favorite of the month was Secret Bunny. So you might be like, what is Secret Bunny? Um, I came up with the term for it, and I'm pretty proud of it, but it's pretty much like um, Secret Santa that people do around the holidays. So for Easter, my friend group decided that we wanted to exchange Easter baskets because it's fun and why not? So what we did was we wrote down everyone's name and drew names. So then we had a person and it was like a secret and we went shopping for them and got them an Easter basket and then we exchanged them. So we had a $10 limit. Um, we got baskets to put the stuff in. Um, most of it was candy and such, but I um, put like some sidewalk chalk and bubbles and stuff in mine um, that I gave. Um, but I'm going to show you guys the one that I received so then you guys can see um, how Secret Bunny worked for us and then maybe you'll be interested in having Secret Bunny for you. I know Easter's super soon, but you know, it's a fun tradition that we decided to start this year, so I'm pretty excited for it. So I got this llama basket. Um, I have a thing for llamas, I guess. I mean, I have this llama. I have Gerard the llama who made an appearance last time. Um, I have a llama on my planner and that might be all the llamas I have, but people are feeding my llama addiction. So, you know, um, llamas are the new Kelly symbol. Um, so in my Easter basket, I got some cool socks. These have bunnies on them. Socks are always a great option for any season. Um, I still wear my Santa Claus socks and snowflake socks now, even though it's like 70 degrees outside. Um, so socks are always a great option. And then candy. So M&Ms are a classic. Um, personally, I love peanut butter cups. Um, and there are some twit, yeah. Twix. Twix are good too. Um, I ate a lot of the other candy because I got it earlier this week, but no shame, right? <laughs> um, I also got Sour Patch Bunnies. Like, what? They're so good. Um, so, I also got Pitch Perfect because um, I love Pitch Perfect. Anybody else there with me? Like, Pitch Perfect is a quality movie and it's my favorite, so it was a good present. Um, but, this was my Easter basket that I received, and it was a lot of fun just to um, see what everyone got each other and then be the recipient of a gift because, you know, Christmas was like three months ago, and, you know, besides birthdays here and there, um, receiving gifts isn't something that you usually do uh, other times throughout the year, but being able to have that secret bunny exchange was super fun, and it's definitely something that we're going to do in the future. So, hopefully you like the term secret bunny because I think it was pretty clever on my part. Um, might be a little biased, but that's okay. Um, but secret bunny was super fun. Um, hopefully you're interested in doing something like that. You can always change it to a different month for a different holiday. So, you could do something um, later in the month like a, for Halloween or for the 4th of July or really whatever you want it to be. Maybe even a friend anniversary. you can have like a secret friend anniversary thing, but I'm not really sure how that would work since there's usually only two people in a friendship. Anyway, um, hopefully you enjoyed this month's favorite of the month. I know it's a little something different. Um, it's a new tradition for us as a friend group, and I think it's going to be something that's super fun and will carry on. 
So hopefully you enjoyed this month of favorites of the month and check back next month for something awesome. Um, April is going to be a crazy month. It's the last full month of school. Um, so there's so much stuff on my calendar already. So hopefully it'll be a great month to um, be able to have different things that I'm going to purchase and then be able to go and do different things. Um, it's going to be super crazy, um, super fun. I'm, I'm definitely looking forward to it and I hope you are too. So stay tuned for another episode of Life with KKP.